Shalak nain niyet tay ko tansa kaitik ko chintin lida di chanta di chinen nai ha enchit kringhi niyet ko tanerhi talbat zay di ki esik enchit adatza chukla tin kerenli ay tatak kajan masicho shalak nain nisan we came long ways. I came long ways to be here. I'm honored to be here standing on this land of the first people of this land, the sacred land. I am honored to be here. I'm honored that the Creator been good to me. Thank you, Creator. Shalak nai my all relation, I'm proud to be part of Goldman family, to be here. We need to protect Arctic National Wildlife Refuge. Repeatedly, over and over since 1988, the people of the world, people of the United States, telling us the Arctic National Wildlife Refuge need to be protected. It's clear, clear message to me that they want coastal plain of Arctic National Wildlife Refuge protected permanently. We need to reach out to our youth and mentor them. This summer, we had a gather of young people. They said they're gonna, not going to let this issue go and make our elders and leaders very happy. They dedicate and have ceremony dedicating solar system to their future and their generation. It gave us clear message what our young people want. We are caribou people. It's our clothing, it's our story. Every time caribou come through Arctic village, we say, what say, what say? Everybody get excited. Our heart beat fast. We say, thank you, creator. Thank you. We're going to eat good again. It's our clothing, it's our story. We do caribou song, we do caribou dance. It's who we are. If you drill for oil there, you are drilling right into the heart of our, our existence. It needs to be protected permanently. Because they made that decision, that doesn't mean they're gonna quit. We're gonna continue to be there to protect our way of life. We're not going anywhere, we're, going to, we're here to stay. With that, thank you again. Shalak nai, chiti ke kurin hi te kuna te set e tara in te kurahna. Ai ke kurin hi te kuna. What we're really talking about is subsistent way of life. We're talking about sustainable community. That's what we call in Gwich'en, we say, etara en. With that, thank you very much. Shalak nai masito, shalak nai. Elders, brothers and sisters, friends of the earth, people of San Francisco, Shilakai. This is such an inspiration to keep on our struggles in our homelands. In all our work that we do, it's absolutely imperative to maintain spiritual guidance and direction by our elders and our messengers from the spirit world. 
I'd like to say a special thank you to Rhoda Goldman and to be accepted into the Goldman Prize family. The Gwich'in's history, culture, and environment are inseparable from the ecosystem and that the center is the caribou. The way in which I was raised, we don't receive gifts of great honor on just, be, on just behalf of ourselves. We wouldn't exist without our culture, our natural environment to be so vain to accept this on my work alone. I accept it on your behalf, on the many people across the United States of America and Canada who has helped us and throughout the world. Today I am deeply honored to stand before you to be recognized by the Goldman Prize as a representative of my people, a spokesperson, and an ecosystem more precious than I can ever describe. The Arctic National Wildlife Refuge has become a very high profile conservation issue in the world. For my people, sustaining and nourishing this environment, praying for her and the sacred calming grounds means the continued survival of our people. This past week, we achieved a great victory in the U.S. Senate. You, the people of America, had spoken loud and clear. However, we know that the multinationals, the, this administration, are not going to give up. So our work has to continue together. I accept this award not only on behalf of my people, the Guchin, the land, those who cannot speak the animal world, that we are undeniably connected to. More importantly, I accept this award as another symbol and inspiration to the belief that we will, we will win this fight to protect the sacred calving grounds of the Porcupine River caribou herd and the future of my people. And I thank each and every one of you here tonight. And I ask the people of the United States of America to please Stay with us on this one. May the Great Spirit guide you all in all our work. Thank you very much, Mr. Goldman. I've been in this world. 70 years now. Never in my born days did I expect to be honored and talk to my people of the United States at this night. And I'm really emotional. Usually I'm not when I'm fighting for the rights of the Native people. When I was growing up, I have no education. I went to school for three years. But I taught by my people to fight for them. Here I am, 60 years later, still fighting. But on the behalf of the Kuchin Nation, on behalf of the Kuchagochen Yinji, on behalf of my family that stood behind me, all these years, I accept this award for them and for you, the people of the world. The people of the United States together owns all the land of the Arctic National Wildlife Refuge, 1002 land that we're talking about. It belongs to you and I that it'll be there where our great-grandchildren can enjoy it. When I go, and my, my bishop is in here somewhere, he always says to me, peace be with you. We say more of that to one another with God's love. We will always accomplish what we started to do.
tonight for celebration, we're going to sing and honor the four direction with what's that? It's caribou skin hot dance. As the indigenous people of the world, we welcome our visitor. We share. And this is the song about welcome. This is a song for invitational song. We're special people that way. We're just that way. And this is Caribou Skin Hot Dance, named by Jeh Chatsah. <laughs> 